This is very good. In today's conversation, we are talking about the top 10 Equifax credit cards for bad or fair credit that approve you with high limits. Think about that. This is just fantastic. So I want you to stick around till the end of today's conversation. Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Sweetie Kiwi Show. How are you today? I hope you are doing fantastic. I'm doing marvelous, if you ever ask me. If you are doing as great as I am, go grab a cup of coffee or tea or vodka and let's roll. <laughs> In today's conversation, I want to speak to you about the top 10 Equifax credit cards for bad or fair credit that actually approve you with high limits. Actually, for, for position number 10, we have two credit cards that are tied, okay? So the first one is, the, and I just want to say that the, the first few credit cards will be from credit unions, but afterwards, don't worry, we have uh, credit cards from regular institutions also, okay? So we have number 10, NIH Visa, NIH FCU Visa, okay? The, the rating here is 7 over 10. This is a great card that actually uh, approves you up, up to $25,000. Obviously, you got to be a member of a NIH FCU, okay? The card has no annual fee. They have great low rates and fees. This is like, this is really good. And we love the fact that they have an exciting intro rate and rewards offers, okay? And uh, the, the uh, peculiarity in our case of, of this card is that they allow you to actually have online card controls for you can you can manage a lot of stuff on your account they have a great app okay they have 24 7 fraud monitoring and visa lab visa zero liability so a great card and they have digital wallet mobile payment options fantastic so nih fcu visa 7 over 10 and the second card that is tied for position number 10 we have highway visa platinum our score 7 over 10 also this is the highway is also a credit union and uh, it's great if you are a member and the card the card has it has a uh, credit limits that ranges from uh, $500 to $25,000 okay here you have uh, a no foreign uh, you ha actually have a 1% foreign transaction fee but the cool thing is you can have a 1.9 percent intro APR for 12 months on purchases and balance transfers okay the rates here it starts from 8.95 percent okay so this is really good i mean highway credit cards in general are very they are full of benefits you have emv fraud protection automated fraud alerts and uh visa zero liability okay you have a for you obviously you also have a travel accident coverage okay this is and they also have a great app also number nine we have here credit human rate preferred this is credit human is a credit union also and our score for this credit card is 7.7 .7 over 10. here the apr goes as low as uh, 8.65 percent but you also have a balance transfer rate also that is kind of cool a promo rate uh, and uh, you have no annual or balance transfer fee so this is kind of cool when you think about credit human rate preferred you're thinking about a car that has a constellation of, of benefits you have press protection and extended warranty services okay you actually have also uh, you have uh, Identity theft, uh, identity theft protection also. One thing we love with this card in general is that when you are when you become a member of Credit Human Rate Preferred, this card allows you to monitor your expenses like uh, in detail. So we love the granularity that this card affords you when it comes to a credit when it comes to expense management and monitoring. Fantastic. Number eight, we have here Logix Platinum. Our score, 8 over 10. So Logix is also a credit union. And so this card is kind of cool because they have a variable rate that starts at 9.74%. And then you have a 0% intro APR for purchases and 3.99% to 8.99% APR for balance transfers for the first 15 months. Okay, So you, you only have a 0% intro APR on purchases. For balance transfer, you have to you have to pay more. But th so this card is kind of cool because uh, the card has uh, no foreign transaction fees. Okay, auto rental coverage. They have trip cancellation insurance. They have Mastercard Airport Concierge. Fantastic. They have a Mastercard Global Service. 
identity theft protection, master trip travel assistance. This is really great, okay? And they also have a great app, so you have uh, the ability to have your mobile wallet, Apple Pay, and Google Pay, or Samsung Pay. Fantastic. What we love with this card is that uh, they have unique card numbers. So you have card, the cards that you order for uh, your spouse, joint owner, or other authorized users will have a unique number making it easier to identify the card used for each purchase. This is really good, especially especially if you have a large household, if you have a lot of folks in your household and you want to differ, differentiate expenses, this is really cool. So Logix Platinum, eight over 10. Number seven, we have Fairwinds Cashback. This is a great card for cashback, 8.3 over 10. Okay, so again, the cashback, and uh, Fairwinds is also a credit union, okay? And they are a credit union. And uh, with this card, you have 1.5% cashback on part on purchases. The APR here oscillates from 10.89% to 18%. This is kind of cool though, okay? And here you have a 0% intro rate on purchases and balance transfers for the first 12 months. So if you happen to have to be a member of, of uh, Fairwinds, this is a great card to consider. You have no annual fee, no balance transfer fees, no foreign transaction fees, okay? You have a mobile wallet solutions for Apple Pay, Samsung Pay, and Google Pay. And they also have a, a large catalog of features and options with this card. I'm talking about purchase security program. You have travel protection. You have warranty manager service. You have account alerts, ID navigator, online surf service, roadside dispatch, zero liability. Fantastic card. And one thing I also need to say is that when we talk about this fair winter cashback credit card, they actually, um, once you become a member, they can approve you real fast, okay? And the limit that they can give you can go all the way to $50,000. We have seen people who got a, a credit limit of $47,000. It is totally possible, even if you have fair credit, you just have to apply at a branch or over the phone. Don't apply online. Number six, we have a service credit union visa every day. Our score, 8.4 over 10. I mean, we've been, uh, our team members have been members of uh, service for the last 30 years. This is a great institution. I mean, uh, the people also, people don't give them a lot of um, accolades, but it is a great institution. It is a top military credit union, okay? And uh, this credit card, service credit union, Visa Everyday, 8.4 over 10 is a great card. You have 0% intro APR for six months on purchases and balance transfers, okay? And uh, here, the credit limit maximum is $20,000. Okay, the card has no annual fee. It has no hidden APR increases for late payments, okay? So with this card, there are no surprises. We love that. And uh, so, so you have 0% APR for intro APR for six months. Okay, six months on purchases and balance transfers. And after that, your purchase and balance transfer APR will vary from 9.65% and 17.65%. Okay, this is kind of cool. But again, you have a lot of benefits here. You have travel and emergency assistance services. You have emergency card re re replacement. You have a lot of uh, features. Number five, folks, we have a citizen's clear value. Our score. 8.8 .8 over 10. So Citizens is not a credit union. It is a bank. So uh, everybody can actually uh, be a, a customer. Not a problem. If you are in Citizens Geographic uh, coverage, okay, with this card, what we love with this card is that you can get 0% intro APR on balance transfers and purchases for the first for the first 18 billing cycles. Think about that. 18 billing cycles okay thereafter you have a variable apr that has uh, that oscillates from 14.74 percent to 22.74 percent okay and so this is really cool this is really good i mean and with this card you can you can actually do a lot a lot of things so here are in our view the best features and benefits you can save so the card has no annual fee zero percent intro apr on balances okay balance transfers and purchases for the first 18 billing cycles and uh, we also talk about security and uh, protection in terms of their uh, the features you have external warranty protection you have it theft protection you have travel ex uh, travel accident and baggage uh, delay insurance you have a contactless card okay and you have zero liability protection this is really cool and we also love the fact that citizens has really done a lot of a lot of work lately in their customer service department they're really nice now the people are they have stellar customer customer service okay and so you have uh, you actually can contact them and on top of that what we love with this card is that you have a 21 day grace period on all purchases with your clear value mastercard so this is really great so overall great card citizens clear value 8.8 .8 over 10. number four 
we have here Truist and Joy Cash. So Truist Bank is a bank, okay, great bank, original bank. So they're they're not the national player though, but they're original. And if you are a member, if you're a customer rather, if you're a customer of that bank, you might want to give a Truist and Joy Cash some uh, a try. You know, you have three percent cash back on gas. 2% on on utilities and groceries up to the 1000 monthly spend cap and you have 1% on all other eligible purchases that's one option the second option is 1.5% cash back on all eligible purchases so you don't have to uh, track uh, categories okay and this card has a 0% intro APR on purchases for the first 12 months after your account opening this is really great the APR here is kind of cool too it goes from uh, 14.74% to 23.74%. Okay. And one thing I want, we love with this card is that your due date is at least 25 days after the close of each billing cycle. Okay. So they're not charging interest on new purchases if you pay your entire balance in full by the due date each month. Okay. And the card, as, uh, this card is, is kind of cool also because they have all the um all, all the regular catalog of services they have a uh, roadside dispatch they have a uh, travel protection they have id theft protection and of course you have uh, a car that is backed by uh, the full uh, customer service the stellar customer service of tourist so this is really great tourist enjoy cash nine over ten number three we have the pen fed cash rewards visa credit card our score 9.1 over 10 so obviously PenFed is a credit union so for to access this credit card you need to be a member but the cool thing is PenFed is open to everybody everybody okay doesn't matter whether you are uh, affiliated with the military whether it is uh, professionally biologically or uh, or uh, um, geographically you, you can qualify okay and uh, with this card you can get a decision in as little as 20 seconds the cool th one thing I want to tell you here is if you have bad or fair credit it's a lot it's better to apply at a branch or over the phone because if you apply online your chances of getting a credit limit that is high are limited okay but this this card has 1.5 percent cash back on all purchases that percentage goes to two percent it goes to two percent if you are a pen fed honors advantage member okay you have a 100 dollar statement credit as a bonus when you spend fifteen hundred dollars in the first 90 days okay the purchase apr on this card discount is a little high though in our view is a is relatively high you have 15.99 percent to 17.99 percent but hey it is what it is okay benefit is a great institution that allows you and this card allows you to earn cash back for everyday purchases okay there are no caps here there are no limits here there are no gimmicks here there are no tricks here okay and uh they had the card has no and no annual fee Something that's kind of important also, right? All right, I'll be right back. Right after this, don't go anywhere. Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Street Gateway Show. We are still having a conversation about the top 10 Equifax credit cards for bad or fair credit that approve you with high limits. Number two, we have Discovery Cashback. Our score, 9.5 over 10. So this card is kind of cool. The card has a rotating categories though. Every quarter, you have to actually uh, monitor those uh, categories, but we love that because think about it. The card first has a no annual fee. This is really good, okay? And uh, you have 5% cashback on everyday purchases at different places each quarter like amazon.com grocery stores restaurants gas stations and when you pay using paypal up to the quarterly maximum when you activate plus you earn an unlimited 1.1 percent cashback on all other purchases automatically okay so there's not so this is but again the card is kind of cool because uh you have zero percent intro apr for 15 months on purchases not balance transfers though on purchases very important to mention in terms of rewards everybody knows the uh the standard uh dollar for dollar match that discover has okay so they actually match your purchases dollar for dollar i mean uh, not your, your rewards rather dollar for dollar okay in terms of the cash back you earn at the end of your first year automatically it, it, it only happens the first year though okay and this is kind of cool but overall this is a great credit card number one the best of the best in our view when it comes to the top 10 Equifast credit cards for fair or bad credit that approve you with high limits we have the key cashback this is a great card because it allows you to earn up to 2% cashback on every purchase with no annual fee think about that 
Okay, so they are, they are paying you back on all purchases, not just groceries and gas. There are no categories or limitations with this card, okay? Obviously, this card is coming from the from, from Key Bank, okay? So you have cashback rewards. You have 1.5% cashback on purchases, 2% cashback for clients who bank and save with Key. So you want to be part of the Key, key Bank uh, sort of uh, context or ecosystem, okay? And, and they have an intro APR. So you have a 0% intro APR for the first 12 billing cycles on balance transfers made within the, the, six, the first 60 days, okay? And after that, your APR on balance transfers will be 18.49% to 25.49%. Really kind of decent, okay? And uh, one thing I want to say is that this card has a constellation of uh, features and benefits. So first of all, you have, you can, you have unlimited 2% cashback rewards when you bank and save with KeyBank. You always earn at least 1.5% cashback. You redeem your cashback easily. You have you have uh, access to your FICO score. This is kind of cool, okay? So you can monitor your progress in terms of a credit worthiness. You have the card is uh, the card allows you to have all the benefits of Mastercard. So this is really good. So key bank key the key cashback 9.8 over 10. Great card. <music> Before we close to this conversation, I just want to have a, a quick overview about the cards we talk about. It's really important to say that uh, there are a few things you need to be aware of if you want to apply for an for an Equifax credit card for bad or fair credit. Okay, this is really important. And one thing I want to say is, how do you get a, that kind of credit card in the first place? Well, you need to decide why you want a credit card. It's important because you just don't wake up one day and say, you know what, I want to get myself a credit card. No, it doesn't work that way boss you have to think about that decide why you want a credit card check your credit score you want to shop around for the best credit cards offers okay whether they they pull equifax or they pull experience or they pull transunion okay you need to read the fine print and apply for the best credit cards for your needs very important for your needs okay so when we talk about deciding why you want a credit card do you want to build or rebuild credit it's important do you want to earn rewards are you in debt and paying high interest do you want to transfer balances do you have a big purchase coming up do you travel abroad? Those are things. I, those are questions I want you to think about. Okay, and check your credit score, because you might be thinking, you know, I have a, I have a fair credit, or I have a bad, I have bad credit, but you never know. You gotta check your credit score to to ascertain, like to know, to confirm that you indeed have a a bad credit score or a fair credit score. It's very important. So when we talk about very poor, what well, we have uh, three hundred to five seventy nine. Those I'm talking about the, the FICO credit score ranges. Okay. For fair, you have 580 to 669. For good, you have 670 to 739. For very good, you have 740 to 799. And exceptional, you have 800 to 850. What I'm talking about here is you might be thinking, you know, I have bad credit. But who knows? After checking, you probably realize, well, you know, I'm not really that, that bad. I have fair credit or I have good credit things happen you have the opportunity to actually uh, check your credit score and the uh, file disputes if you see something not something really a little fishy on your credit score on your credit report it's always good to actually check it okay and uh, you want to shop around for the best credit card offers here actually in today's conversation i share with you a mixture of uh, credit union credit cards and uh, regular bank credit cards that pull like equifax you want to shop around Okay, if you are looking for a, a, a balance transfer card or no annual fee or travel card, or, you, you got you really have to think about that. Okay, and you want to read the fine prints, please don't make the mistakes of getting the credit card because you are all excited and you just make the mistake of not reading the fine prints. Read the fine prints and apply for the best credit card for your needs. Again, I want I really want to insist on that. Your needs are different from my needs, are different from anybody else's need. Make sure that those needs are taken care of when you apply for a credit card. Let me give you a few pro tips here. Here is how you want to do things, okay? First of all, you want to understand the credit card eligib eligibility requirements. Again, as I'm talking to you, you want to be strategic about the credit card you choose, but you have to understand what kind of eligibility is this credit card uh, asking? And the thing is, can I actually meet them? So we're talking about age. You need to be at least 18 income okay some cars want you to have a minimum of twelve thousand dollars gross income every year you got to have residency or citizenship okay if you are part of a credit union you have to actually match their uh, eligibility in terms of uh, in terms of professional affiliation biological affiliation or geographic affiliation or some in some cases religious affiliation okay and your credit score also you have to think about that. So there are there are bits of info that you need to submit 
in terms of your application. And as we always say, it's, it's a lot better to apply at a branch or over the phone than apply it online, especially if you have bad credit or fair credit. Okay, so they will ask you for your personal information. Okay, we're talking about here full name, date of birth, social security number, your country of citizenship, and uh, your contact information, your address, email address, phone number. This is really important. And this is where they actually get interesting. They want to have every, everything about your financial information. Okay, I'm talking about your employment status. Okay, this is important. Your total annual income. Yeah. So we're talking about your non-taxable annual income. So you have a first one is gross annual income. And then you have a, a after tax annual income. Okay. They also want to have your monthly housing cost because they're trying to actually uh, ascertain your DTI, your debt to income ratio. Okay. They'll ask for your bank account information. Okay. And uh, in some cases during the application, they might ask you to actually uh, key in authorized user details so if you want to add someone else like a kid or a partner to your account you will need to include uh, his or her name date of birth and address okay and some issuers may also require their social security number and uh, if you want to do balance transfers they will ask you for balance transfer details so what I, what I want you to think about beforehand is you want to think about all the info that you need to provide so that you don't apply for a credit card randomly Okay, because you don't want to actually start applying for a credit card and they ask you for some kind of information. And you realize, oh, hey, I did not prepare for this card. I, I need to dig, dig a little deeper to unearth the, the documents they're asking me. No, do the research beforehand and be ready. Before it goes into this conversation, I want to share with you our approach when it comes to a credit card evaluation. And uh, we have a strong approach on this show when it comes to uh, categorizing, when it comes to reviewing, when it comes to listing credit cards. Okay, check this out. Thank you so much. I just want to quickly recap to this conversation. So here are the top 10 Equifax credit cards for bad or fair credit that approve you with high limits. Number one, we have key cashback, 9.8 over 10. Number two, we have Discover cashback, 9.5 9.5 over 10. Number three, we have PenFed Cash Rewards Visa, 9.1 over 10. Number four, we have Truist Enjoy Cash, 9 over 10. Number five, we have a Citizens Clear Value, 8.8 over 10. Number six, we have a service credit union visa every day, 8.4 over 10. Number seven, we have Fairwinds cashback, 8.3 over 10. Number eight, we have Logix Platinum, 8 over 10. Number nine, we have Credit Human Rate Preferred, 7.7 over 10. And then number 10, we have a Highway Visa Platinum, 7 over 10. Another card tied for number 10 is NIH FCU Visa, 7 over 10. Thank you so much for your attention. I really appreciate it. I will speak to you another time. But until then, remember, stay marvelous.